Sante Buana, Sante Buana, Sante Buana, Yesu, Buana, Yotenda. Oh, my God. 
word was brought to me. A finger came that you misguided people. So the sin of misguiding. You go to somebody's wife or somebody's daughter. If the wife is up in a abroad, is in Nairobi or maybe anywhere. So she's waiting for her husband or waiting for her husband. She's not thinking of anything evil. But then you go to her and you until that fear goes away from her and then she partakes in sin together with you so that will be added to but you have begun with the sin of be guiding first this small one was not thinking about this sin but then you followed her and coaxed her until she partook in sin you are going to repent that you committed but then in another way there is a sin hunting for you that you misguided and you made her to break the trust in between her and that she has waited for one year because the husband is outside until she sees that her children suffering and she wasn't seeing that then you are misguiding this small one then there is a rock will be tied around your neck. Kwako, Syphilis will come to you. Not the ordinary ones that you can be prayed in the name of Jesus and be healed, until you come and say, I misguided. Amen. Amen. That girl was never thinking of anything evil. But then he was somebody seducing girls for your brothers or siblings. There are people who are doing that work here. You are siblings. They are telling you that they want that girl. And she's not thinking of that evil. But then you go to her. Oh, my brother wants you. My brother wants you. Until the respect she has upon her parents. Until the trust she has can go away from her. Until the, in her heart enters that evil. Until she protects in that evil. Amen. Amen. You have misguided this girl. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You have misguided this person. 
Then a rock will be tied around your neck. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. A rock will be tied around your neck. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We don't know the rock of the, the rock right around your neck. We don't know what you, may be. you may see some small issues looking like they have no opening. And that is a rock. Lakini, but ukijaliwa moyoni if you're enabled in your heart kutofika not to have attained kunyenyekea humbly kutojidhani kufika not thinking yourself to have attained kukubali kurudiwa that you, it should be clear in your heart that you can Mungu accept to be chastened then god is saying he'll deal with you and with sons so tena you read for us again that verse ni kwa ajili ya kurudiwa mustahamili mungu awatendea kama wana maana ni, ne, ni mwana yupi asierudiwa na babaye if you endure chastening god dealeth with you as with sons for what son is he whom his father chasteneth not nilipona kweli mimi i was truly healed nilipaka leo hata jana nimejenga magoti until today but even yesterday I, knelt down. I told God forgive me for misguiding all those people it is yesterday or the boys and girls they were small really in the village making them partake in evil and they were hearing me and I was instructing them and there isn't anyone who said anything hallelujah hallelujah so I'm still saying God forgive me for misguiding those small ones. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.